8, how to create a blob effect. Now I've seen a lot of people do this differently, but I believe this is the easiest way. Create an ellipse, control D to duplicate, move it aside, and you need to add a merge path and an offset path. That's it. And once you have that, decrease the amount on the offset path. You see this outer radius that is formed when that's interacting. You have this weird effect going on. Just change the line join to round join. And you already have it. And now it's just a matter of keyframing the position property of these ellipses. So let's do that. Let's click on both the ellipses and type in position to get the position property. Set keyframes and add an animation left and right and adjust the easing. Okay, so you can duplicate, you can keep duplicating these ellipses and have many number of many number of these to show kind of a mutating effect like I have here and you can play around with the uh, position to create this cool kind of animation also if you change this to Milter join uh, you get no, you get a whole different effect like this and you can keyframe some of these you know you know you can create some cool effects with that too um, maybe spend some time to play around with it I think it's really cool and that's it for me uh, this helped please do leave a like and subscribe and stay tuned for the next one bye